This is a Galaxy Tab Pro S running Windows 11. Now this one is the Core M3 dash 6Y30. It's 90 hertz and it's actually got a boost to 2.5. It's 8 gigs of RAM and 256 gigs of storage. This is a 6th generation Core M3 which they said is not compatible. I'm running a beta build and it runs a lot faster than Windows 10. When you go into the store, it runs smooth, runs fast, don't have any issues. Websites load up fairly quickly. There's a little stuttering, but I've only noticed it in Edge. Keeping all this in mind, I think it's a mistake to leave a leave behind sixth generation CPUs. I think they should go down to fifth gen. Maybe with a, maybe with not all the features, but I think it's a mistake to leave behind any 6th gen, especially the prices these still go for. The special edition like this is harder to find, but the 4 gig models, they range anywhere from 200 to 500, and this came out back in 2016, so it's still a premium product and I think it's a huge mistake to leave it behind now this is not a review this is just showing that it is running it runs fairly smooth fairly quick everything's snappy responsive no issues whatsoever and I've had no problems with everything loads up fairly quickly it's perfectly fine that was just a quick look at Windows 11 later on we're going to look at games and everything else but thank you for watching